Hi, I'm Chris. And I'm Cynthia. And we're the Hanye family. And for those of you that are new here, welcome. And let's enjoy some great music together. Okay, so what do we have for the Goonies today? Well, today's Friday, so we're going to do our Friday favorites for you guys again. Oh, yeah. And this time I found one on our list that I was really excited to do. And this band is Heart. Heart. Yes. Yeah. We know a lot of their hits, of course, mostly stuff from the 80s, to be honest. Mm. Um, we know some of their 70s work, of course, some. but not very much, the to good be stuff. honest. Yeah. The good stuff. It's all good stuff. What am I talking about? We just don't know a lot of the stuff. We yeah. know their major hits, though. Their major hits. Barracuda, of course. Everyone yes. knows that. Uh, crazy on You. Yes. Big time. Uh, <laughs> Magic Man. Wonderful song, by the way. Exactly. I absolutely adore that. I listened to that when I was working at Subway, and it was like the middle of the night. And I was working my eleven to seven shift. I would play that, and uh, well, it was a there was a disc that I brought to work, uh, a CD, and I had that and a whole bunch of really crazy, awesome songs that I, I used to play all the time. I only was, really learned a lot about that side of heart when I was a little older. Uh huh. Yeah. Because as a teenager, I thought Heart did Alone and that kind of thing. You know what I mean? Yeah. That um, version of Heart. I still like that, mm -hmm. but it's not as good as their 70s stuff that no, I've heard. No. Yeah. Again, just like her. I mean, we same era. So I yeah. grew up, when I first heard the name Heart, I heard Alone. That's me too. Yeah. And I went to, I even, even the lip sync contest that I went to at <laughs> yes. somebody doing Heart Alone. I was like, oh. Yeah, that's the heart that we were first introduced to. And then when we heard some of their older work, it was so much more dynamic. Or was that us that did that? What? I think it was me and my cousins that did that heart song alone. Oh, <laughs> in I think the that was the one. Yeah, I think that was yeah. it. Uh, yeah, we used, I used to lip sync contests all the time. Yeah. Yeah, because it was fun. You know, you didn't have to actually sing. Small oh, towns, they had some interesting little things sometimes the, like that. Uh, the lip sync contest in the early 80s was big everywhere. Yes, Sorry. I did it too. Yeah. But later, it was later. It was more like dance than it was lip yeah. sync where well, I was. The way we did it and the reason we kept on winning is because we would perform. Like, uh, you yeah. Yeah. Uh, some people wouldn't know how to. Yeah. <laughs> the first, okay, we, the heart one, we lost. We just done a band came on and, and lip synced to a song that they knew well yeah. so they won it was just as that but uh and we had f like fake guitars and stuff and they <laughs> came, up, came up with real guitars and we we're like okay yeah you're gonna win this but we should definitely get into this one in a minute it's mm -hmm. called soul of the sea soul of the sea and it yeah. was suggested by um sorry monero mark monero mark yes yeah well, uh, he's definitely been very vocal on our channel lately, and yeah. uh, he's been uh, asking for a lot of great songs, and I imagine this is uh, one of them. So. Yeah, I would say, because, well, Heart never disappointed me yet. Well, yeah, so. and like <laughs> as we were ranting on, on about how we used to do lip sync contests, uh, we knew everything about Heart from the 80s, of course, because yeah. we grew up in it. But it took us a little while to realize that, oh, they did stuff in the 70s. Yes. I remember my cousin saying, oh, yeah, they did this, they did this, they did this. And they were like, okay, that's interesting. So mm -hmm. they're not a new band, but they are definitely keep, they kept, definitely kept going. And as soon as Much Music came on and started showing them, first they showed, of course, the big hits. But then they started showing us other stuff, like the Barracuda video. That, uh, yeah, that, I fell in love right away. Yeah. That song. So we really were interested in them for a while after that because yeah. they were amazing mind you we didn't go delving so we don't know a lot about dreamboat annie no nope, we really don't <laughs> yeah. we know i think magic man's on that one i don't even know you would I know more think so and i think i may have come across the actual dreamboat annie song once oh really but i'll listen to it again i know i haven't so yeah, yeah. but we should get into this we should so let's been do that. We've talking a lot. We've been, sorry. <laughs> yeah. I mean, we started talking about lip sync contests. That's just yes. exciting, you know? <laughs> so let's get into it. Uh, all right. So let's get into it. Yeah. This is Heart with Soul of the Sea. Thank you. 
This is very different. Yeah. It's so gentle for what I'm used to with heart. That's true. You know, and it's got these quirky little things about it. Yeah. Well, I mean, it first starts up with the sound of the sea, seagulls yeah. and water. And stuff. Which I almost expected, honestly, yeah, well. that part. But then you've got these little, like little noises in there. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. Love the guitar work and the bass work. Yeah, so very nice. well played. Oh my goodness. Of course it is. Yeah. But it's so beautifully done and beautifully sung as well. Mm -hmm. You know, that voice, the minute she comes oh, in, yeah. it's like, oh, wow. Yeah, that's why I love heart right there. Yeah, Anne and Nancy, they're amazing. Anne's yes. got the most incredible voice. She really does. And the songwriting, I mean, I know it's both of them probably. Yeah, but yeah probably. I would probably think. some of the bandmates too, because, you know, you just got to, round that out a good band really comes together and puts things you know into place you know yeah but this is so nice it's just very different from what i'm used to with them yeah and they're going into a different yeah it feels altogether, different again right? it's just done another change up and it's really cool yeah very interesting yeah so this, let's get going with it yeah wake up late with us On the street until the day The people I meet have nothing to say No smile, no sorrow No laughter, no tomorrow Practice all the tricks for them. 
That was so well done. Yeah. Oh my gosh. What a different sound for them. It went all gentle and stuff at the beginning. And then it transitioned into this quirky kind of feel. And then it almost got into like she was angry. I, That's how it felt. I feel like it might have been a dream that she was coming out of because she was by the sea. And she, yeah, was good. it's possible. And she wakes up and the phone rings and, and she oh, has, that's heads out possible. into the street and she's... You know, and nobody's got right. any kind of yeah feeling of any kind apparently yeah and nothing to say yeah exactly so you know and I, when she says silence at the end yeah she hold that holds that note right until it fades out and you can I hear know. you can hear her cracking just at the end it's just so she crazy. held it she held it for as long as she could and she just yeah. kept it until they faded it off you could hear her cracking at the end though yeah they they they, they made a they might have kept that a little too long. Maybe you're right. I was, was trying to figure cool. out what very it was cool. all about, and I couldn't figure it out at first. But maybe you're right. Maybe it was a dream thing. I think so. I don't know. It would make sense because it, then it went right back to that same feeling at the end. Yeah. The like exact same. Yeah. Rested, and there she was back in the sea. <laughs> Just a really interesting song. I'm not sure what it's all about for sure, but I'm I'm guessing you guys will let us know as usual in the comments. Yeah. We well, really love this band. It's really great. I mean, the compare a lot of people like to compare them to uh, you know, Zeppelin in that way. Not that they're a hard rock band. They definitely are not really a hard rock band. They're they're a great rock band though. Yeah. Oh yeah. And they definitely worship Led Zeppelin. You can hear the interesting things that they do just to try and seem interesting. Things. Well, I can see it even with this song, because like I said, that one part felt almost like a very odd switch up. Yeah. Well, when know? she says time, 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 that's, it's very Robert Plant. Oh yeah. You know, but this is very interesting stuff. I'm so happy we got to do this today. Yeah. This is a great band. They always yeah. were a great band. And, and when they started out, they were just, uh, all you know passion and energy was really yes great. and anytime we can learn more heart songs i'm i'm in yeah, no problem for sure and i hear that they might be writing some new stuff yeah. and i'm very excited about that i'm yeah. definitely going to want us to do some of their new stuff if they do that well i mean they said something about touring and then yeah. something happened and somebody got sick um oh was it Anne? it was ann she yeah. had to go in for some surgery i think I'm not sure exactly what something it was. happened. Yeah. I don't remember. But they they kind of postponed for a bit. I don't yeah. know if they're going to continue. I mean, I hope so. Yeah. But I also hear Kate Bush is writing new stuff. Interesting. And oh, who was it? We just did this other one. Oh, somebody else is writing again too and putting out new music. And we just did one of her songs, and for some reason it's slipping my mind. Okay. I don't even remember who was it. Oh, I don't remember. Anyways, we've got some n older artists that are doing newer music again. Yeah, and we're more than happy to check that out because... Absolutely. By the way, we should go back to some of the stuff that we know that some of the uh, new older artists have done. I've seen recently, um, actually we've seen over the past few months, a handful of artists that we used to listen to that yeah. 
have put out stuff just exactly a lot of our older artists are tending to come back and put out new music honestly and i think it's because a lot to do with youtube it does it I, really I does think, i think these reaction channels including ours yeah not as much i have kind of yeah. encouraged them to go ahead and do more well, exactly uh, you, you have people like uh well there, there's a handful of reactors who are even at a point where they're interviewing some of these old older artists yeah. and people like that and getting to talk to them yeah which really wakes up the market for the for their kind of music so you're gonna hear probably a, a handful of older artists coming back just to try it out yes so thank you very much for this request it was obviously definitely appreciated mm -hmm. please don't forget to check us out over on patreon it's three dollars a month and we're adding things there all the time you'll find the link in the des description of all our videos you'll also find our blocked videos there for free if you'd like to come and check those out you're more than welcome to do that and if you pay the three dollars you get access to your albums documentaries and little concerts over there it's a whole lot of fun yeah don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel and become one of our Goonies. Share with your family and friends. Click the notification bell if you don't want to miss a video. And don't forget to enjoy yourself. Later. Later.